What's going on, guys? Appreciate you guys tuning in for our first ever YouTube season of Texas Boys Outdoors TV. Really excited about it. We're going to do some cool stuff, and we get asked quite often, what exactly is Texas Boys Outdoors? So for episode one, we're going to show you how we get it done. Texas Boys saw with our military veterans, first responders, and some really special kids. Let's get rocking. That's what we came here for right there. Come nice on. Job, man. Nice start for today. We've been here about 10 minutes. I'm more with Texas Boys Outdoors. That's what it's all about. So big part of what we do at Texas Boys Outdoors, it's actually part of our mission statement, is giving back to our heroes. These guys have given up so much, you know, first responders, military veterans, these guys have spent a lot of their lives and some still continue to serve the community, serve the state, serve our country. So we like to get these out there, do a little hunting, a little fishing, get it done Texas Boys style and show them a good time. So let's check out a few highlights of some very special trips we've had over the last couple years. I'm gonna hop in the boat with a couple of United States Marines, including my good friend, Mr. Joey Mowis. Guys, got a purple heart, just a, a true warrior in every sense of the word. Multiple deployments overseas, just put his life on the line for our country and excited about getting Joey out here and let's see if we can get it done, Texas boy style. Got the cameraman catching big ones. You like a good one? Oh yeah. Oh, they're right in front of the boat. Play with it a little bit. Yeah, those things are so strong. Right where they're going down, they're right there. Doubled up, man. Yeah. That's, that's Texas boy style right there. Got a big old red. Just let him fight. They are strong enough so they can rip the hook out. Not a horse in too much. Oh, yeah, that's a giant. Watch that power bowl. There you go. He, he saw the boat and was like, hey, I'm not ready yet, man. <laughs> they get a second wind sometime when they see the boat. Yeah. That's a giant. Look, he's got some real pretty spots on him. Got it. Nice yeah. job, dude. Good job. Woo. That is a big old yeah. Texas-sized bull red right there. Monster. <laughs> You're just like that. He's not actually good. No, he's too big. Too cute, but he's big. Got him. Dude, this, this is about a, that might be like a He's probably about an inch too big, but he's a big one. Nice, built on spicy pumpkin. Like we said, we caught a few trout earlier. Eric said he knew his spot. These birds are working, trying to get some redfish. Been here five minutes, as you can tell, catching some redfish. Got our United States Marines doubled up. Good job, boys. That's about 25, 30 pounds worth of redfish right there. Probably about 40 pounds worth of redfish. Those are two studs. A lot of fun. All right, good morning. We're here in Gallison Bay. It's midsummer time. Got my buddy Captain Eric Renteria helping out. We got a group of uh, military veterans and first responders. We're gonna get here try to wade the back of St. Louis Pass. Got a little breeze this morning, but it's been pretty good. That water's you know protected over there, so it should stay a little green. And we're gonna get here and see if these fish are biting and try to get it done Texas boy style. You guys stay with us. Hey, I got another one, man. Man, that sucker, dude. I need 
was a good one. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Not a night 20 inch trout. He just he just had a 15 inch, 16 inch get away and he's frustrated. So back door with the next cast caught a good one. That, that's how you do it. Good job. Harris County SWAT boys getting it done. Nice red, about 22, that might be a little bit bigger than mine, it's about a 23 inch red. All right, you can see, man, had an awesome time out here today with our first responders and a couple of military veterans. Appreciate Captain Eric helping out. You know, anytime we got with Eric, if, if there's fish around, we're gonna catch them. These guys did an awesome job and really cool to get them a break from their everyday routine and out there catching bad guys. Appreciate their service and keeping our community safe. Good time out here getting it done Texas boy style. I'm Texas Roy, we'll see you guys next time. So we had a pretty cool opportunity here. We have our own United States Army veteran, Zach Bercher, and we have special guest, a guy named Zach Griffin, another United States Army veteran, never been deer hunting before, never shot a deer. We're gonna try to get him out in South Texas. Our buddy Brett Merritt hooked it up, get him on his first buck, see if we can get it done Texas boy style and send him home with some good old deer meat. Hopefully a deer died. Like your first time squeeze a trigger on a deer? Uh, yeah. How'd it feel? <laughs> it felt great. I just want to go find him. I want to find him now. Whew. <laughs> you can breathe it down hard over there. Yeah, yeah, it's uh, pretty intense. <laughs> oh, right here. Hi. There he is. <laughs> That's not even. What are yours? Hey, thanks, yeah. man. Hey, appreciate it. Grab that sucker. Hey, oh, yeah. That your first there he is. ever. Number one. Man. Yeah, he dropped quick. How were you feeling when that deer walked out? <laughs> you got him behind that scope. Hell yeah, I felt, felt amazing. Oh my gosh, thank you guys for all this. This is uh, uh this is amazing. Congratulations, man. Thanks. So a big congratulations to United States Army veteran, Zach Griffin on his first deer. Pretty cool deal. So I think it's pretty obvious here at Texas Boys Outdoors that the military veterans and first responders are a huge part of what we do. But we also love getting out there with the youngsters and working with Shriners Children's Hospital over in Gallison has been such a blessing for us. We're gonna get out with our buddy Fabian so we can get out here. There's an awesome kid and a trip I'll never forget. Fabian's gonna try to get it done Texas boy style. Uh, we had to make a nice little run actually from the causeway kind of the far end of West Bay, but Captain Eric's been fishing over here for a little bit and said he knew where some trout were. They, at least they were here the other day. So gonna get out here and do it to it and try to put Fabian on his first speckled trout. Get it done. There you go, good job Fabian. Oh, he's pulling. Feel him on there? He's on there, keep going. Yeah, oh, baby, oh, good oh, job, oh. man. In the rain, good job, give me five, bud. Awesome job, man. Here, you hold this part, I'll grab him for you. Hold, hold the rod. This is called a speckled trout. That's the kind of fish you caught, you got it? 
That's a good eating size one. Too. Oh. You want to get a picture? Maybe he's hooked up. We think he's got a good one. Oh, you got the fish? Does the fish have you? Keep reeling. I have the fish. You got him, huh? Yeah, Hi. buddy. Yeah. That's more big. That is a whopper, man. Good job. Yeah. My man Fabian on his first time ever bay and trout fishing and he's getting it done, buddy. Hey. Say getting it done. It's a big fish. Can you say I'm getting it done Texas boy style? Say that. Uh, getting it done I Texas like boy Texas style. Boy oh, awesome. That's good. That's good enough. <laughs> Always a great time out there with the youngsters and Fabian, let me tell you, was one that we'll always remember, just a fun kid to get out there. And there was a little bit of a language barrier, but we've learned that sometimes with fishing, it's universal language and that smile says it all. But Shriners isn't the only organization we work with. We work with Texas Children's, work with other, other kids that just recently lost a parent or guardian. So let's check out some other really special trips from really special kids and get it done Texas boy style. All right, keep going, keep going, keep going. Oh, here we go. Yay! I got one more. Yeah, hey. I know. I haven't got any yet. He got a little bit bigger that time, huh? Yes, we're getting bigger. We're getting bigger. Oh, that's a cool fish. Is that a keeper? Oh. No. You want to touch him? Sure you can touch him. Like, just touch him right here. I'll touch him with you. Look. Yeah. Look, baby. It's just slick. Look, 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 you can touch him. I'm not going to do nothing. Look, baby. They're teeth, but they're not going to bite you. Keep, look, you, look, hear him? you hear him croaking? Yeah. So he would, that's he would. really weird. Yeah, that's cool. pretty cool. Huh? <laughs> I'm not wearing my uniform today. Off duty? Off duty. Five. Good nice job. job, girl. Keep reeling. You got it, girl. We saw him come up. Yeah, you gonna put the yeah, right there. There. That's that's it. It. Whatever nice. it takes, that's baby. It. You got the net, okay? Awesome job, Abigail. Mama, you got it. Get him, baby. He's getting. Oh, that's a good one. Look at him. That's a pretty boy. He's that's a keeper. Hey, he's we're a keeping keeper. this one, baby. That's a good one. Get him on. We're keeping this one. Look at that. Bring him around. This. Hold on. A little bit more right here. That Zach is getting oh, the net. It's a good one, baby. We're keeping this one. Come on, we're keeping this Ooh, one. Look at him killing that drag. Keep reeling one more time. Now it's, I'm gonna pick him up and try to swing him to Zach. Ready? He's a Hold good on. one. We're gonna get him in. Let me see it real, real fast. Bring him in, baby. It's a keeper, baby. Yeah! Oh, Give me five, that's girl. Oh, that's, that's a keeper. That's another try. That's on 26 and Brent. Nice job. Hey, turn around. Hey. Let me tell the camera what you just did. I got a big fish that's 24 feet. 24, 24 feet. feet. All right, we are ready to rock and roll. We got my main man Carson. We had a fun morning. They saw you got hogs, turkey, and a couple bucks, but just not the right buck. So we're gonna hit it this afternoon. We had a big full moon, so we think these deer, a lot of time when you got a full moon like that, they'll sleep in the morning because they're up all night. So usually you have a good afternoon, they'll be on their feet. You can try to get it done Texas boy style. You guys stay with us. Oh, we had a couple of bucks come in, kind of checking things out. Hopefully they'll bring their buddies and come back in. So here we are, we've got about two minutes of shooting light left. I'm pretty much thrown in the towel. I'm about a, a half mile from them hog hunting. Just figured we aren't gonna get it done. I feel bad for Carson. And all of a sudden, boom! Pretty sure I just heard a gunshot. Good shot. He got it. Hopefully. What do you, what do you think, Carson? Oh, that's crazy. <laughs> what do you, wow, right at the last minute. Yeah. Ooh. The last second, man. It was getting dark. It was getting dark. Yeah. Good thing for good optics, right? Yeah. <laughs> Way to go, man. Really... What you say, buddy? Yeah. We're on TV. Remember that? I don't know who's shaking worse, yeah. bro. Yeah. <laughs> All three of them just walked out. Hey, congratulations, buddy. Good job, congratulations. Buddy. Good job. Good job. Look at that rack. That is a beautiful deer, man. Unbelievable. We don't see those running around the woods very much, huh? No, <laughs> sure sure That's a beautiful dude. Dude, congratulations, man. Outstanding. 
Awesome. Dude, check him out, Clark. One, two, three, four, five, six, a beautiful, beautiful day. That's a heck of a South, that's a heck of a deer anywhere. So what an absolute amazing experience being down there in South Texas with a young man, you know, going after his first deer. Carson's just had such a rough year with the chemo and the treatments and in and out of the hospital. You know, it's tough on the whole family. So to be down there with dad, he got it done on a big old beautiful South Texas buck. Just an awesome deal. Appreciate you guys tuning in this week and we appreciate the support. Glad you guys got a chance to see what Texas Boys Outdoors is truly all about. Make sure you subscribe to us on YouTube. We're going to be dropping a couple of these videos a month. Really excited about the new YouTube season. Hope you guys like it. I'm Texas Roy. We'll see you next time.